Robbers have held up UDF stores 12 times in the past six weeks. That's twice a week, folks. And a police chief is warning that it's just a matter of time before one of these scenes turns violent. Tom McKee is on your side with the tips to keep you safe if you get caught in one of these situations. Tom? Well, the keys are doing whatever the robbers demand or cooperating with them, and then at the same time doing whatever it takes to keep yourself safe. Now, the robberies have happened twice at store number one here in Norwood, along with Elmwood Place and Mount Healthy, plus the Cincinnati neighborhoods of Westwood and Oakley and Ridge and Carthage. UDF officials, well, they're reviewing all their safety and security policies to try and prevent these from happening again. 12 UDF robberies in 46 days, most of them at night or the early morning hours. Surveillance cameras captured images of several suspects, but nobody is in custody. Norwood Police Lieutenant Ron Murphy says robbery squads are working 24-7. It's just a matter of time before uh, it turns violent. It did once in 1992 at the Oakley store and clerk Francis Messenger was murdered. Cedric Carter was sentenced to death in the killing. That's when UDF stores had one employee and stayed open 24 hours. Now two workers are on duty all the time. Cincinnati Police Sergeant Eric France says clerks staying safe begins with paying attention. A lot of times these robbers telegraph they're going to come in. They may walk in and out of the store a couple times or they may be in the parking lot putting on a mask. UDF has 174 stores and 2,400 retail employees who are taught safety first. Offer them whatever they want, encourage them to leave, make them understand the police are on the way and that they should leave immediately. And the employee should never leave the store with a robber. If it gets to the point where they're forcing out the door, you need to realize it's not going to end well and you need to do everything in your power to survive. But what if you're a customer? Take care of yourself, get out of the, get you and your family out of the store and call 911. UDF issued a statement saying the recent robberies are prompting a top to bottom safety review. As part of the normal rhythm of our business, we regularly review our safety security policies and practices in the hopes of deterring and preventing robberies from occurring. Now I asked UDF Human Resources Director Mark Wilson if they're going to put security people inside the stores. He said that's going to be considered along with any and all suggestions that they come up with when they consult with the police agencies in the different jurisdictions where these robberies have occurred. Tom McKee, not on your side, live in Norwood.